So lo and behold, sometimes that's what a dog says when they're a little snider and, you know, they're a little bit, they feel like, you know, somebody was hiding something from them, you know. The man, it wasn't coming clean to me. It was kind of, you know, he just wasn't giving me all the information, you know. So you feel a little, you know, I don't know what you feel. It's like, you're, so you just let it, you just go. So lo and behold, wouldn't you know, the man thought he was pulling the wool over my eyes when we went up there to the Chinese store. You know, it's an amazing thing. They built that, they built that mountain road like it could be filmed in commercials. And right there, the vicious switchback. It's a vicious horseshoe-shaped curve, you know. Right in that thing, they built the store, the Charney Country Store. And wouldn't you know, the real reason we stopped there, I thought we were just joyride. I was like, I was getting sick, but I was like, this is an incredible mountain road or, you know, transversing. But so, but lo and behold, the whole thing is that the man, that's where he picks up some of his fireworks. So somehow the Charneys, they, they do fireworks. They're into illegal you know, so I think those Charneys, I think Charney is the, is the they shorten the name Charney uh, from something that was more uh, Uruguayan, like they, you know, because that's where he gets his, it, most of his fireworks, he says, come from Uruguay. So uh, these people must be really l absurdly large, tall Uruguayan hillbillies. They're Uruguayan transplanted hillbillies. I don't know if they're natives, you know, or if they're, you know, but it's a really, they look, it looks like Shaggy from Scooby-Doo. They kind of all look like they got orange hair. They're really tall and they got gangly necks and big Adam's apples. And they go, hey, cousin Charney. And they greet each other that way. And it's pretty, you know, it's, it's very folksy and very homey. But, you know, that's why we go up there. And I thought it was for the sunburst lemonade that you can't buy anyways else. It's like extinct. And you can get up there in the glass bottles for a dollar a bottle. They have a whole storage area of them. They pay like three bottles for a penny. And with inflation and everything, they sell it for a dollar. And they're kind of making a great living off of that. Very, very, like you're just barely sustaining yourself, but it's very consistent. They're very happy with the selling of those glass bottle. You have to have a thing to flip. They have to have to have one of those bottle cap removers to even open them up. That's how, that's how you know, old school they are. But, you know, they, they, they look like Shaggy from Scooby-Doo, and they come wandering in and out. And when they talk to you, when they talk to me and the man, they kind of talk grumbly voice like they must smoke a lot of cigarettes or chew on a lot of tobacco and swallow it. So they got a scratchly low voice. But I think it's the, they're disguising, or that's the voice they use to the outsiders, because when they greet each other, they go, Hi, Cousin Charner! And... You know, they all call each other Cousin Charney, and they're so happy to see each other. Like, the best part of their day is when they see their next cousin. And that's a wonderful thing. They're so tight-knit, you know. But that's what we're doing up there. That's where we pick up. I, I think he has other sources. Maybe these ones aren't even Uruguayan. Maybe the other kind. I forget what the other kind even was. Uh, but maybe these, uh, who knows, but this is definitely one of the black market pickups that the man uses to obtain his fireworks that he sells to the 12, 13, 14-year-old set. But whatever, it's okay, you know. But I just wish the man would have told me, you know. I wish he would have been up front with me. I wish I would have known what was going on. I would have felt a little bit more comfortable. But that's what we're doing going up there to the Charney grocery store up there in the switchback.